there was a time that uh, I was up at my trailer and I needed to use the cell phone for whatever reason and I'm inside the trailer obviously I knew it wouldn't work because the trailer is made out of metal and I'm out in the middle of nowhere northern Wisconsin <clears throat> and so I stepped outside and I tried using it there and it was real sketchy you know you had to be in the right place mostly uh, out by the road which is four or five hundred feet out there so anyway um, I decided to try to put a cell booster in and I ended up uh, connecting everything up properly and raised it up on a pole the antenna the receiving antenna outside it was about a 10-foot pole it was attached to a 10-foot platform water tower platform so I think I got it up there like 15 feet that really didn't work so I had another 10-foot section so I was up to 25 feet and I was getting sporadic cell service no way to turn the antenna so I just tried to guess on it and I realized that I need to go up higher and I needed to have a directional antenna so what I ended up doing was finding a Roan 40 and uh, then the next question was well how do you put all that up and keep it up well um, to get it all the way up I didn't want to use a pole to a gin pole to keep going up one section at a time so what I did is I built a base hinged the base um, cemented uh, supports into the ground to hold the base and then used a winch to pull the antenna up from horizontal plane on the uh, parking lot and it worked out real good so this video is going to be probably quite lengthy. I haven't started it yet. I've kind of compiled some of the video uh, to the uh, editor, but it'll end up being longer than most, I would imagine. I'll try to keep it at five minutes, but really what it is is a, a long drawn out project that uh, was done successfully and maybe you can glean a few ideas from this to do it yourself. The other thing too that I probably won't get into in the video is that this uh, uh, is all done with a remote control. So in other words, the uh, winch is on the base um, and attached to the antenna and there's a solenoid and a battery involved and then a like 15 or $20 remote control uh, key fob that uh, you can buy with the circuit board. It was really inexpensive to make it remote. I just didn't want to be standing around there with a long piece of wire and a connection so I did the remote and it worked well. So hope you enjoyed